what it do, Coralist fans. It is a really hot Arkansas day. It is June the 2nd, I believe. Time for an update. Quite a bit of development. Um, I must admit, I got ahead of myself. And um, I did a few things without you, but don't worry about it. I'm going to get you caught up. With that, yeah, we'll get to that. As you can see here, our peppers are slowly but surely trucking along. We're starting to see new growth on both plants, so they're alive. I'll, I'll take it. Ooh, excuse me if I'm pausing these mosquitoes and literally eating me alive. Our pumpkin. It's finally started to bud its fruit. I've pollinated that one and this one earlier in the morning. As you can see, it's starting to close up. And as time progresses, I'll do the same with the rest. See, we got a visitor in here putting in work. Appreciate it, fam. Do what you do. I'm not sure what this melon, this vine is, however. It's coming along. Definitely getting some healthy fruit sets. There we go. All the way up the vine. This one happens to uh, curve over. It's doing all right. This jump is doing crazy. I mean, it is putting on a hell of fruit. Check it out. Okay, guy, not gonna bother you. Hey, man, we gotta. People, we have a healthy vine, damn it. What more can I say? Be time to eat after a while. Let's take a peek. Oh, yeah. That is a healthy root system. And they all look like that mainly. I'm gonna try not to be out here all day, people. I hurry up. Be time to top this one off. Here within another week. I might do it today. You can see I made some strawberry corn is looking good and check it out. Apparently I did put one in there. It was just slow rolling. As for this, I clip the ends off of the two main vines. Um, one side being ensured there was another healthy fruit set on there. Uh, why? Because I'm wanting to promote growth to all the side nodes and I'm wanting, to, wanting them to shoot out in every direction to truly fill out this canopy in this area and to instead of just having these loop back and forth back and forth our fruits are definitely looking good if I can get a better shot yeah amazing color look at that Check it out. This one's coming along. That bad boy is done for. We won't worry about it. I 
our Charleston Gray slowly coming along. Um, so far, that's actually the only fruits that I've seen on this vine. Then again, I have been stressing it out because I seem to snap every damn new shoot that pops out. But we're getting there. Like that one, for example. And that one. But it's still growing, so I'll leave it be. So you want melons today, what are we working on next? Ah, we have another cantaloupe in the corner. This one is actually budding. This one isn't in the crack key hydroponic setup, just soil. Well, not just soil, some pretty good stuff. There we go. Greenhouse makes all the difference made all the difference check it out i got two right here yeah they just continue on up a few i've already pollinated there we go i mean this is non-stop it's almost made its way to the canopy This, I'm almost certain, is a bush sugar baby variety. It is just creeping along. Definitely healthy, but creeping. Um, this is the Clay County yellow meat that, well, two of them that took about a month or a month and a half just to get to this point. Um, I forgot to shield the bucket, so it was getting way too much sunlight, and the algae choked it out. Even now, I'm starting to get a bit more but at least I'm getting a healthier root system uh, I'll end up spray painting this bucket by day's end alright meal and peppers other than that man that's about it um, waiting on our gentle seek to make its way to the canopy's top it is definitely taking off since the last update I'll try to keep this thing from getting too long these are some clippings I took about a week or two back from some of the melons as I was trimming. And I wanted to see if they would actually root. Um, they're still green. Um, they haven't dropped any leaves. So I'll assume they rooted. We may pop one open later. A random tomato finally, finally it's making an appearance in the canopy so now we can start letting these side shoots actually grow instead of pipping them off and it'll spread out starting to get some nice new sets and the stuff towards the bottom is starting to ripen that's the one I'm waiting on Well, people, it's hot. There is a lot of stuff in here. A lot of tomatoes hidden. About another four or five plants in there with about 20 or 30 tomatoes. Whew. For another day, we'll end it off with a kiwi. We are here.